Why are you pressing buttons? Why is you pressing buttons, Factor? Why are you pressing buttons? Why are you pressing buttons, man? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hey guys, um, this video is about my puppy. I bought him and I think, I think I bought him last month. I've had him for about three weeks. He's eight weeks. He's eight weeks now and he's full of energy. He got the cutest little personality and he's the cutest little puppy in the world because he's my minions. My bubble double dubbers. Say bye, Mello. Bye. Hey guys, um, if you can tell by the um title, he doesn't want to do this. But I had him in my other video and I wanted to do a video for him. Just this video is based only just because I want to save this video for when I want to look back at when he was a puppy. So yeah, I'm gonna do a puppy update with my puppy. So um this is Milo and he is a full breeded, full breeded miniature schnauzer. Um, he is black and silver. He's a bad one. He's bad. Um, he is about, ele he's 11 weeks. I got him when he was six weeks, and I know that that's illegal, but the lady that was giving him to me, that was selling me him, she didn't seem like she was fit for, for puppies. I'm just gonna let you know. She didn't, she was not fit for puppies, and I didn't want my baby over there another minute, because I felt like she was gonna try some scam artist shit and try and keep my dog, and that wasn't gonna happen. So, this is Milo, my Milo. That's my Milo. That's my baby. That's my brothers. That's my minion. But this is my baby. Um, I'm going to hold him up here for as long as I can hold him because he doesn't want to stay up here. He's just like a child. He gets into everything. His little temperament issues. He's, he's, he's really good. Like at eight weeks he was already learning he was already knowing how to sit because i was teaching him that and now he knows how to sit he knows how to lay down um uh recently we let him walk up the steps because i wanted him to get used to it he knows how to run up and down the steps but i don't let him do it without me being behind him because i don't want him to tumble and fall um he has all of his teeth well most of them um, when we first got him, you could tell, you could see the, the teeth forming underneath his gums and they haven't came out yet, but they came out and now his bites hurt like hell. Um, he just recently got his first puppy bath. Um, he hasn't got his shots yet just because I haven't been able to get him there, but he gets his shots this week. So that's a plus um he's not he doesn't even know what i'm talking about but he's gonna be like what the hell when he when he gets them so yeah um also he's good with potty training we recently just stopped putting the puppy mats down we try and take him out every couple hours or so to let his back bladder get used to waiting um he has a big personality he has a very big personality he's very hyper I'm gonna put him down now because he, he's bucking because he wants to get down. He wants to play with his toys. But anyways, um, he he's a very good puppy. Um, so if anybody is interested in a schnauzer, they are the best breeds to me. Um, my mom has a schnauzer, which was my dog. Um, his name is Onyx. Onyx then had puppies with my auntie's schnauzer. So he has three puppies but they were all adopted my Jima has his son Bentley I named uh, I named Bentley Onyx was named by his breeder um and then uh Fiji is his mom Fiji it, Fiji is Bentley's mom 
which my Jima's dog, um, that's his mom, and her sister had uh, Roxy, but we don't know what happened to Roxy, so I'm just gonna leave that at that. Um, the other dog is with this, um, I'm not trying to say any, say it as a bad thing, but with a, a white a white woman, he went with a white woman, um, and she got him traveling the world, doing all kind of fun stuff, so that's good. She posts pictures of him all the time, so I know he's doing good, um, plus I would rather him go with her than um, anybody else because other people will say they care for dogs and don't really care for them and me I'm a big animal lover at heart so that would really mess with me if something was to happen to that one because something happened to Roxy and that's one of the reasons why I don't recommend giving them away to relatives but anyways um so my Juma has Bentley which is Onyx son my mom has Onyx and I recently just got me a Schnauzer so it's kind of a Schnauzer puppy Schnauzer puppy family we love Schnauzers um but anyways he's about he's getting bigger now he's not that big because he was the runt of his litter um it was like five puppies he was the runt he was the smallest one and I picked him because he just was so cute. When I brought him home, he did not cry. He just knew my scent because I gave him a toy when he was a puppy and I rubbed it all over me and stuff. So he already knew me. Um, at night, he sleeps for the most part. When we sleep, he sleeps. Um, he loves my boyfriend. They're like the best of buds or whatever. Um, that's who he's with during the day. Sometimes when my boyfriend goes to do construction jobs and stuff, he kind of takes them with him. And he's in the AC while he, while my boyfriend's in the heat. And if he's working in the building, then he lets him run around and stuff while he plays. My puppy um, will not leave my boyfriend's side. So if you take him off the leash, she's fine. And which is weird to me because puppies have short um attention spans but his is really good because their breed is very smart um he's just now learning i mean just now starting to bark at different people um people that he doesn't know people that come around us that he's not familiar with he barks at them and then growls and then he stops he never attempts to bite them he just barks from distance um also he is a blue puppy he eats blue um, right now I got him lamb and oatmeal um, the lamb and oatmeal flavor he loves that I had him on chicken at first because that's the only one I had seen um, but yeah he loves that food um, when he first came I had to give him water out of a bottle because he wasn't trying to drink his water out of the bowl um, and yeah so I recently went to PetSmart and I got him um, pumpkin and Halloween toys just because every season they have uh, Halloween toys all the time or they have Easter toys or Christmas toys so I'm going to try and collect them as much as I can. He was born in the summer on June 2nd so there wasn't any summer toys. They don't have summer toys, they just have seasonal toys. So yeah, he's a good puppy for the most part. Um, Ever since we've been walking him, um, he's been going potty, so he don't potty in the house, so that's good. I'm trying to get him used to a schedule where he can go to the door and let us know, hey, I gotta go like my other dogs do. But yeah, so that's, that was basically the update on him, and I'll show him to you one more time. Right now, he's trying to get into stuff. Come here, my love. But this is my bubbies, and... I will do another update if you guys are interested. Um, if you want to see more puppy updates just to watch him grow, you can um, leave a comment below and I will try my best to do updates if he cooperates. So, yeah. Say bye, Milo. Say bye, mommy. Say bye, mama, baby. Say bye. Bye. Hey guys, um, I know you're going to kick my ass because I have not uploaded any videos, but there's a reason to that, and since then I did blonde my hair again, but it has grown out since, so it's black around the rims, but that's what I wanted. Um, but anyways, 
I recently was looking at some videos and I got this hideous bump on my face. That's the only bump on my face. But anyways, I was looking at videos and I seen these cute little videos that I had of Milo when he was just a little tiny itty bitty puppy. Um, so I decided that, and I know that probably most of you are going to be like, why are you giving us these kind of videos? But I don't have anything else right now because, um, we're currently trying to save money. So I can't do any hauls on anything, but I promise around November 15th-ish, I'll be having more videos, like, um, of hauls and all kind of things when I get, when we get things situated. But I wanted to go ahead... I wanted to go ahead and do another video right now. I'm just gonna hold on one second because I smell something burning. So I'm gonna go ahead and do this video right now. And here he is, if he lets me grab him, he's too busy trying to look out the window. But here's Milo. Say hey, baby. Look. Look, Milo. Look. He needs a cut. He's going to the groomer's, um, he's going to the groomer's, uh, Saturday. He loves to climb. He's a hopper, for real, but that's how big he is. But he's going to the groomer Saturday, and then um, he recently got his rabies shot um, because he is five months now. He recently got his rabies shot Monday, so I tried to schedule him a down. No, bad boy. I recently tried to schedule him appointments last week. He was going to go to the um, groomers. But they told me that he was due for his rabies shot, so I couldn't bring him in. But he's going um, Saturday, so I will be um, hopefully vlogging that. No, he's real curious about this lamp over here, so he's trying to get over there. Come here. He's real curious about the lamp, but an update, a official update. So, so far... Um, he is about five months. Um, he's very active. He's very greedy. He begs a lot. Um, he's very cuddly. And another thing is I noticed that this ear over here will not go down. I talked to his vet about it and they told me that um, I'll just have to I'll just have to massage that other ear so that it can go up so that both of his ears can stand up. I personally, um, I personally don't like it. Milo, down. No, bad boy. Another thing is his temperament. He is very hard-headed. Um, you can tell him something a million times and he will not listen to you unless you point, if you point your finger, he'll try and slap with his paws. Um, he'll try and slap you with his paw and he will not he he will not listen at all i have to yell at him a lot because that's the only way he will listen but he's very curious he's a very curious puppy um and i absolutely love him he he was so worth everything and another thing is that he do that weirds me out is he goes into my dirty clothes hamper and he will pull my bras out of there he will pull my bras from out of there and um, chew on them. And then he loves this window because schnauzers have personality. They they have cat traits. Like I don't know how to say it, but they act like cats. So they want to sit in the window sill all the time, or they lick themselves a lot, clean themselves. Like right now, he's trying to get to this light over here. I put the lamp in the window because um. Right now it's dark outside as you can tell with the window open. It's very dark and we're on the third floor so there's not much light coming in here. Milo, no! You're a sick kid. But yeah, um, he's scratching right now but that's another thing. He did have fleas. Um, he had fleas but when he went to get his rabies shot they gave him a pill so um, 
he's good for a month. Right now, he's just scratching the scratch because he hasn't scratched in about two days. But yeah, that's my baby. And I'm not going to do much of a big update on him because, again, he's a puppy. I mean, he's not a puppy, but he is um, a dog. And I know people are going to say, well, he's a dog. Why are you doing updates like that? But he's my baby. He's my fur baby. So, yeah. So, say bye to the camera first before you storm off with your crazy stuff. Say bye. Say bye, babies. Say bye, my cub. Good morning, because you're not for me. Say bye. Say bye. You can tell he's still the same way. He likes to buck out of my hand and do what he want to do. So, I'm going to let him do what he want to do. But, um, while I'm talking about this, this is going to be probably be a long video, but I don't care. Um, and I got a scab on my nose from him biting me. But anyways, um, I know I have not been posting any videos. And I know I said this earlier, but I do apologize. And um, I just want you guys to bear with me because I've been really debating on reordering that tripod that I told you about um, that never came. So I am probably going to order it again and use Amazon Prime so it can come in two days. And then I can do other videos, maybe some um, updated hair routines. Um, I do have some lost footage of when I was preparing my hair to bleach. I will be bleaching again, but probably in like a couple months from now. I don't want to do it anymore because I want to let my hair um, continue to blossom like it is. So, um yeah so if you have any questions or you're about to adopt your first dog and you don't know what to do if you need any help or if you have any questions in general about this channel then go ahead and drop it below i will see you guys next time bye So this is what happens when you take your eye off of your puppy for a, a few seconds. Why did you do that? Why did you do that, Milo? Look at it. It goes all the way over there. He even pulled my Bath and Body Works box from over here to over there. Why did you do that, Milo? Why you tore up mama pillow? It's good. Is it good? Why you do that? He knows he in trouble, y'all. Cause he know I don't let him do that. And he got my pillow sitting on the floor too. I mean, I cleaned up. It, what you see is what you get. This is all that's on the table. And he pulled that box from right there and brought it over there. And now he's going back to the pillow to tear it up some more. I mean, I've been needing to throw that away, but this is what happens when you deal with the puppy. He still don't care. He's still dragging it, he's still pulling it. And I don't want y'all to think I'll just let him do this because I don't. I will pop him, but you know, that pillow was already damaged, but he's really messing it up right now. Milo. I told y'all.